Um, I, I can't help but notice that your grow troughs are empty. There's yeah. nothing in it. What's going on? Because some people are going to watch this and say, oh, they're not growing anything. What's going on? So can you tell me what's happening here? Sure. Well, again, w one of the main factors is that we're just coming out of the summer. These raceways right here are set aside for our leafy greens. So we're growing our lettuces and kale and chard here, and they do much better for us starting in the fall. So we'll, we've actually got them seeded and planted now. They'll be introduced in the system in the next 15 days. But for us here at Morningstar Fishermen, we're really focused on training and helping others to help themselves. We're not a production facility. So you don't actually take heaps of stuff to the market? We do not. We don't do that. We have a few restaurants that desire our product, mm -hmm. and so they'll come to us and, and take what we produce. Uh, but honestly, most of our food we consume here as staff or students or volunteers, and whatever is left gets to the, given to the fish as a fish food or it gets composted. Well, that's not a bad plan anyway. No, it works I mean, well good. for us. We're yeah. all happy with it. Yeah. Fresh salads and lots of fish. Just come over this way a bit while we're talking about that. What in the world are you doing here? This, uh, this is another one of our research projects. Uh, these are topsy-turvy tomato plants. Uh -huh. uh, so we're growing all of these tomato plants upside down. The, the concept here is that we would water these with fish water from the aquaponics system. They're again growing in soil that we have produced. Um, this accomplishes several things. One, it utilizes space up above our, our yep, grow beds. Vertical, which, vertical space again. Correct. Mm -hmm. uh, the other thing that it does is it eliminates the potential of leaf mold that comes from tomato plants planted in the soil mm -hmm. where rain will splash up and, and create a leaf mold. Mm. And these are a compact variety. You told me earlier what they were. What are they? Uh, these are called patio tomatoes. So they're a compact bush. Correct. They'll grow to about 18 or 20 inches, which will work perfect here. Actually, you've noticed as the plant begins to, to develop, it grows upward towards the sun. But you can see the, the one plant, who's the first one to do it thus far, as it matures and starts to put on tomatoes, it will fall down. And so all of these will be hanging straight down and producing mm. fruit. Looks great. Okay.